The points race is the last of the six events that make up the Omnium, with results from each giving each rider a collective ranking. All eyes were on the golden girl of British cycling Laura Trott and her nearest challenger, Jolene Dora from Belgium. Raced over 100 laps or 25 kilometres of the track, points are awarded for sprints every 10 laps. Dora was trailing Trot going into the points and closed the gap with a win in the third sprint. Another British rider, Katie Archibald, was also in good form, taking one of the sprints. But it was all about the battle between Trot and Dora, who traded sprint wins at the end of the race. And although the Belgian rider won the race overall, it was Trot who took the Omnium title. It's good to see that my speed was there, if my endurance wasn't. Like, I really, really struggled in the points race at the end. It was more about kind of defending the points that I did have rather than trying to gain any more, I guess. When I spoke to you around your first Olympic Games, it was such a whirlwind, wasn't it? And now approaching it, how different is this run up? Oh, I mean, it's completely different. Like going into 2012, like nobody really knew who Laura Trott was. And I was just kind of rolling around and I was just this kid who was just absolutely loving doing it. And I mean, don't get me wrong, I still absolutely love it. But the pressure is just a little bit different now. Like when people, when Hugh used to announce Laura Trott, the crowd would cheer, but it wouldn't be as enthusiastic as it is now. And I kind of do feel that pressure a little bit more, I guess. Um, People were sort of thinking that, oh, the cycling team will bring the gold medals again. And obviously because Worlds, um, I got two silver medals. So I feel almost like sometimes they rely on me to get the medals. So in the end, it was Trot from Dora with Pascal Julan from France in third. <laughs>